I have a story. Tell me the story. I have a story. Tell me the story. I have a story. Tell me the story. There once was a young girl called Natvela. She was very independent. When she was alive, Grandmother Eshe taught Natvela that life would not always come to her. So, one day, she went for a long walk to see what she could see. She saw the big tree. She saw the river. She saw a tall man made of old things. She saw a small garden for baby plants. She saw that these things were the accomplishments of her ancestors and that they had been entrusted to her. She saw people carrying water and men building a house. She saw people selling coconuts and a car that was stuck in the road. She walked and she walked. She saw more things, but these things made her pause. There were people who could not find work. People who had no place to sleep schools where it was difficult to learn, and rivers full of waste. It was then that Navilla felt small and alone. She felt powerless, so she called out to her ancestors, how can we solve these problems? In the wind, she heard Grandmother Eshe. People have always faced challenges. We who have passed cannot solve them for you. But the answer is in front of your eyes. Do you see how Itundi helps Ibrahim lift the water onto his head? Do you see how Kamga, Fru, Tony, and Oben help to rescue the stranded car? Do you see how the house is built? Not by one person alone, but by many men working together, each of them doing his special part. And then Navvela understood. The answer is us. The answer is you and me. The solutions in life will not always come to us, but to face any challenge, we must choose to stand. We must walk together. Mm -hmm.